Hello guys, what's up today? Good morning to all. So right now we are here in the rooftop garden. Our project today will be the observation of the metamorphosis process of the life cycle of the butterfly. And we will be observing for the duration of uh, 10 to 12 days from the transformation of the cute scary caterpillar to a full-grown butterfly. And this is a good science project and this will be an educational documentary blog which I will be sharing to you. We will be observing the third, the fourth uh, stages of the metamorphosis process of the life cycle of the butterfly. And this is good for the students, especially for those in the high school or in the elementary grades to learn more about the life cycle of the butterfly. And for those also professionals, teachers, they can get also some new topic and explaining to them what is the metamorphosis process of the life cycle of the butterfly. And we will go to the observation plastic bucket with cloth net so we can observe a day-to-day -day giving you the details of the transformation of the young caterpillar to a full-grown butterfly. So stay tuned for the rest of the documentary and I hope that you will uh, continue viewing up to the end so you will learn more about the life cycle of the butterfly. Okay, let's go now to the observation plastic bucket with cloth net. Okay, let's go! So again we are here in the plastic bucket and uh, we will observe another caterpillar inside the plastic bucket. Let's open the plastic bucket and see what is inside. Okay, so this is our day one observation for this uh, little caterpillar here. There is another caterpillar attached to the uh, young calamansi tree here and already eaten some of the leaves and it can consume four to five leaves in one day here is it the caterpillar uh, i think she is sleeping you see that caterpillar green color caterpillar so again we will close the plastic bucket so that this caterpillar will be safe from the predators and we will cover it with a cloth screen again okay This is our second day of observation of the caterpillar here in the calamansi tree and we will see if there is some changes. As of now, I think there is no changes. The color is still green and it's still attached to the small calamansi tree and he has eaten some of the leaves above the calamansi tree. And see, it is still attached and there is no changes uh, at all. So, we will wait for another day to observe this caterpillar. Anyway, there's still a lot of leaves to be fed for this uh, small caterpillar. And this is our second day of observation. We will wait for the caterpillar to, to be attached to the uh, small calamansi branch to become a cocoon on a pupal stage. So today is our third observation period for this uh, little green caterpillar and uh, still there attached to the calamansi tree and I think she is resting after eating so she already consumed some of the leaves of this calamansi tree hiding there resting and uh, there is no changes yet to become a cocoon for the third stage of the metamorphosis process so it's still there so hanging on a calamansi branch so we will continue observing this uh, little green caterpillar for the next days we will see if already undergoing the pupal stage for today still no changes yet we continue observing for the next few days So now we are on 
the fourth day of observation period and we will check what is the development and we will have a closer look yeah it's still there it's already on cocoon on pupal stage and you will see the color is not changing it's still green color the same with the calamon sealy so it is positioned like a seahorse with uh, two fibers at the back holding the cocoon so we will wait for another day so for the meantime we will close again the plastic bucket and we will come back the following day So again, we are already on the 11th day of observation period for this uh, young caterpillar inside the cocoon and we will continue observing until we reach to the final moment when the full-grown butterfly will emerge from the cocoon as the last stage, as the final stage of the life cycle of the butterfly for its metamorphosis process. From the fourth day of observation to the 11th year of observation period, there is no changes at all. The same color, the same position, and still on the pupil stage. And we will continue observing for another day or few more days more. Okay? Again, we are here on the 12th day of uh, observation period of this uh, small caterpillar inside the cocoon. And now the young caterpillar from the cocoon uh, already emerged. A rare, young, beautiful, checkered, majestic, swallowtail butterfly. So we have a closer look. Here is the butterfly, it's still weak and just waiting to fly. So we check the other side. So that is the butterfly just emerges from the cocoon and still weak till she cannot fly. She has a multicolored wings with a combination of blue, white, yellow, red, orange, and black. This is the moment of fruit, the metamorphosis process of the life cycle of the butterfly has already completed. So again, we will be observing the first flight of this butterfly. Now the butterfly opened already her wings and uh, started to pump her blood to the wings. So the wings will be strong enough so she can fly to the air and to fly to the outside world. So I will try to touch the young butterfly. Okay, this is my first touch to this butterfly. Yeah. Oh now she's moving. Come on, flap your wings, butterfly. Yeah, see? Now it's moving away from my fingers. Now that is uh, her first flight. This type of butterfly has four legs and two antennas with two wings and a body. So she emerged from inside this white matter which is the cocoon and this cocoon was colored green for 12 days and turned out to be white after the young butterfly came out from this cocoon so the butterfly now is already strong after four hours from emerging from the cocoon and she is already strong and ready to fly to the outside world okay we will catch her now Hello guys, what's up today? Right now, I'm here in our rooftop container garden. In my left hand, I'm holding a checkered majestic swallowtail butterfly just emerged from the cocoon. This morning, it's already four hours since the birth of this uh, young beautiful butterfly. And now, it's time for her to be released to the outside world and to be with the environment. She belongs to the farm. She belongs to the garden with flowers. And I will be releasing her in a few minutes, okay? A few moments later. So here is the butterfly flapping her wings inside a plastic jar. 
and will be released in a few minutes. I will remove the cover and she will fly to the outside world. Thank you for the amazing moments you have given to us and we enjoy an understanding and the metamorphosis process of your life cycle. So this is it. Goodbye butterfly. Another butterfly coming. The same butterfly we have seen. See, the same butterfly we will be releasing to the outside world. So maybe that butterfly senses another butterfly, this new one, to be with her also. Yeah, now it's flapping her wings. And this is my second butterfly I keep to be released. I have already kept two butterflies. The other one already released. And this is the second butterfly to be released today. The door is open for you. You can fly out now. Go, go, up, go, go. Yes, already there. She doesn't like to go. She want to stay in my garden. Okay, guys, so this is it. Goodbye, butterfly. See you next time. In your designated time, come back to my garden and pollinate my flowers. So, guys, that's it. We have already released the second uh, checkered majestic swallowtail butterfly to the outside world to be with the nature, to be with the environment she belongs. And then, if you like this video, please like, share, and subscribe and hit the notification bell so you will be notified for my future videos again this is the urban plant grower saying thank you very much and goodbye to all bye